Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I want to talk to you guys about Brussels sprouts. When I was younger, I used to think that they were baby cabbages and I thought that they would taste like cabbage. Well, they were not baby cabbages and they were bitter. So I have this recipe that I've been doing with roasted Brussels sprouts and it's not bitter. They're really, really good. It's a really simple recipe. Um, all I use is salt and pepper, a little garlic powder, and a little onion powder. And I just pop them in the oven really quickly. Well, not that quick. But I roast them and they just turn out awesome. So, I want to get started with rinsing them first. And I got these Brussels sprouts, they're organic Brussels sprouts, and I got them from Whole Foods. So, just pop them. Sorry, my back is to you guys. So all I do is I just rinse them like really quickly, um, but very thoroughly, of course. I'm just rinsing them. So now what I'm gonna do? Now that I've rinsed them off, I take the, the outer leaves off. And then I'm gonna cut the little stem off. I cut the stem off and then cut them in half. And just pop them in the bowl. I'm just gonna continue to do that. Take the outer leaves off. Cut the stem. And then cut them in half. And you don't have to get crazy with taking the, the outer stem off. You don't want to take that too much off because the Brussels sprout is only so big to begin with. Okay, I'll come back when I'm completely done. Okay guys, so I'm back now. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what else did I do. So I use the sunflower seed oil that I picked up from Whole Foods and I just sprinkle a little bit on. I add a little garlic powder, a little onion powder, a little pepper, and a little salt. And then I just go ahead and then I kind of toss it. Just to get a light coating on um, all the different Brussels sprouts. So many leaves don't, they don't normally fall off when I do this, but I don't know why this particular, or these particular Brussels sprouts are doing that. But as you see, they're all coated. Just wiping off my hands. And then I'm gonna grab a cookie sheet and I lined it with oil. Cause it just makes, you know, it just makes um, clean up so much easier. And then I just spread them out. And then I just pop them in the oven. I um, pop them in about 350 for 25 minutes. Okay guys, here's the finished Brussels sprouts. Um, it took about 25 minutes. Sometimes they take longer. If you cook more, they usually take a little longer. And I usually just don't make Brussels sprouts um, by themselves. Um, sometimes I do, but normally I'm usually doing a roasted veggie dish where I have a lot of different veggies and the Brussels sprouts are included. But every now and then I'll just make the Brussels sprouts by themselves. But they're really tasty. Let me know if you guys are going to try it. If you like Brussels sprouts, if you don't like Brussels sprouts. And if you do try it, let me know how you like it. So subscribe to see more beauty, hair, and lifestyle content every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and comment below. Stay healthy and happy and remember to keep pursuing your goals, plans, and dreams. You got this. Bye guys.